Alright Chris, so here's what I have. Basically a uh, receiver going into the servo body and then out from the servo body into a servo. It's all powered by a, a Beck. But um, if I flip the switch on the transmitter, it transitions from one side to the other. And there's some glitching there. I think it's bouncing. I need to figure that out. But um, that's one fastest duration. But if I adjust this pot here, turn it down a little bit. And you can see it's a little slower. But if I turn it all the way down to the minimum range, this is 10 seconds, roughly. You can see it just crawled along. I basically set it for a range of like I think about 700 milliseconds to 10 seconds. And with the timing on the processor, it's really not 10 seconds. It's actually quite off from that, but it's close enough. Here's a little bit further up. You can actually adjust it while it's going. I'm not fast enough to do it here. Let me turn it down. Turn it down. You can kind of see that. So, uh, there you go. Like I said, most of the time it's pretty reliable. Every once in a while it glitches, and I don't know if that's RF interference, um, you know, causing the, just a glitch in the channel, causing the, the channel to go higher or low or something. I really don't know. Um, but that's where I'm at now. We'll see if I can improve it. See ya.